Hey guys, Wamjam5 here, this is a pre-recorded message I will be adding in before this episode of Back to the Future. I'd like to tell you guys that this video was recorded a while before I took my two week break. I'd also like to ask you guys to like and subscribe. This channel isn't popular and would really appreciate it if you would share this video with your friends. Thanks. Hey guys, welcome back to Back to the Future. Um, this is Wamjam5 and we are playing Back to the Future, like I just said. It's been a, a little while. Last uh, time I uploaded was a uh, Minecraft Survival with Nick. That was about a week ago. Yeah. Week and a bit. Because I've been away, I haven't been able to record, but... Um, I should be able to now for a bit. So what was going on uh, here? Ooh. Yes. Um. When did you lose your shoe? You when you lost your shoe? Shoe? That shoe over there. Oh, that shoe! Huh. Hi, what a nosy Nelly! No one likes a busybody, you know. But. Oh, fine, let me think about it. Uh. Hmm? Yes, I, I remember. I, I lost it in a scuffle with a, a dog. Oh, when was it? Oh, yes. The day that speakeasy burned down. A speakeasy? In Hill Valley? Don't act so surprised, Ooh. young man. Your yep. generation doesn't hold a copyright on moral depravity, you know. Yeah. <laughs> Sin has been on the prowl in Hill Valley since the day it was founded. Um. Lots of old newspaper. newspapers. This is my personal archive. I've got every issue of the Hill Valley Telegraph ever published. Wow. Every single issue. From 1871 to the present. If it happened in wow. Hill Valley, you'll find it in my stack. She's really that old? What's that like? Oh, that's gotta be like... At least a hundred and ten... A hundred and... A hundred and... A hundred and five years old. Wow. Took me a long time, that. Because there's no newspapers the out me. There must be an article about the speakeasy burning down. Naturally. Yeah, I probably wrote it myself. I was quite a reporter back in the day. Any yep, 1980s. Came out? Well, obviously the day after the speakeasy burned down. Um... Wow, a speakeasy. That must have been wild. Is it true they used to drink gin out of slippers like my grandma said? Don't romanticize the past, young man. Prohibition was a time when gangsters ruled the town while honest citizens quaked in their beds. Um, where was the speakeasy? So where was it? That speakeasy that burned down, I mean. That was ages ago. If you're looking for bootleg hooch. No, I I'm just curious, that's all. I'm a, a student of history. Student of history? My Aunt Fanny! <laughs> yeah, your generation <laughs> of hooligans and slackers could give two ripe things about history. Miss Strickland? A video store! Huh? Miss Speakeasy used to be hidden in plain sight down there in the town square, right where that disgusting videotape rental store squats today. So the video store building must have gone up after the speakeasy burned down. The following year, as I recall. Um, nice binoculars. Doing some stargazing? No, oh, I set my sights on the lower things. Is that? 
Whoa. Tiff Tannen. That's got to be important. Okay. Exit. Don't let me keep you from your business. You there! Don't even think about tossing that Kleenex on the <laughs> ground! <laughs> Is that <laughs> Vice Principal Strickland? Mother never <laughs> could keep little Gerald out of her clothes. You also may have noticed I turned subtitles on for this video because you know if you miss what they're saying you can always look at newspapers. Don't touch those! My newspapers are in pristine condition and meticulously organized. Not about to let some street punk get jam all over them. What else is there? Turn around, Marty. Kitchen door. Shoes. Shoes. My kitchen door. Uh, Miss Strickland, how about your tea? Uh, you forgot to turn on the. You! It's spelled with a U! You illiterate vandal! <laughs> Miss Strickland lost that shoe the day the speakeasy burned down. When was that? What are these? Cat trophies. The editorial trophies. Cat lovers quarterly. It's legitimate journalism. Um. Candy. Oh, the candy looks older than I am. Radiator. Man, she keeps it hot in here. That's the kettle. I'll be right oh. back with some tea. Then don't touch anything. Now she's out, maybe we can look at the newspapers. Yes. Juveniles collide with manure truck. <laughs> nice picture. Brown mansion destroyed. 1962. No, no, that's not where Doc's stranded. All right, Einstein brought me this shoe, and Miss Strickland mm -hmm. lost the shoe on the day the speakeasy burned down. But when did the speakeasy burn down? I at least need to know the year. Firm announces plans for Lone Pine Mall, Peabody Ranch to be rezoned for commercial development. Nope. I don't even know where to start looking for clues in these stacks. Wish I could narrow it down to a year at least. Clint Eastwood plunges to death on runaway train. Okay, that's a uh, reference to the third, third movie. Wish I could narrow it down to a year at least. Okay, right. Yeah. Yeah. How do I... Hmm. Yeah, that's peculiar. The water still hasn't come to a boil. Hmm. <sighs> Alright. Excuse me, Mr. Strickland. Again. Let me keep you from your business. Oh, I don't know. Um, cat balls. We haven't clicked on those. Oh, I wouldn't do that if I were you. Miss Pretty Whiskers is very particular about who handles her food. I bet. I bet. 
This is a, a hard puzzle. Huh. That tea's never gonna boil. Miss Strickland lost that shoe the day the speakeasy burned down. But when was that? Um, how's the radio again? There's the whistle! Surely the water's boiling by now! This is a pretty hard game. What's a puzzle? October 28, 1985. Authorities still mystified by Maul's shootout. I don't even know where to start looking for clues in these stacks. Wish I could narrow it down to a year at least. Okay, so it definitely wants me to go down for a year. Search for clues to Dark Thereabouts. October 28, 1985. Authorities still mystified by Maul's shootout. I don't even know where to start looking for clues in these stacks. Wish I could narrow it down to a year at least. Let's try the hints. Uh. Oh. Binoculars. That's what you get with these cheap foreign made kettles but trying to find an american one nowadays Ugh. radiator again i need to check those binoculars there's the whistle surely the water's boiling by now binoculars hey uh mind if i use your binoculars for a sec Go ahead, dear. Rebuilt, Rebuilt February, February 1932. So the fire must have happened before then. But when? I need a date. Don't look at me. I'm far too old for you. Thirty two, nineteen thirty two. I told you not to touch those. Oh right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Got to do the radiator again. There's the whistle. Surely the water's boiling by now. This is uh difficult. But I think I got the idea. Let's see. Ground broken on site of former speakeasy, singer vanishes, Hill Valley Expo delights crowd, soup kitchen exposed. Here we go. Speakeasy arsonist slain. Legal procedure gave way to old fashioned vengeance last night when a mob descended on the Hill Valley police station. The suspect in the speakeasy arson case, a drifter known as Carl Sagan, was pulled from his. Carl Sagan? It's Doc! Killed by a mob. Oh, What's the no. Day? June 14th, 1931. Jeez, I gotta rescue him. June 14th. My newspapers! Sorry, Miss Strickland. Uh, let me... No! You've gotten my history out of order. Oh, do you know how long it'll take to fix what you've done? Nope. June 14th, 1931. Marty's changed into his uh, 1931 clothes. He's ready to go. Marty! Where you been, son? And what are you doing in that getup? Um... Uh, 
Um, it's a costume for school play. Uh, didn't I tell you? I, I got the lead in the school play. Uh, we're doing Grapes of Wrath. Right. Oh, Steinbeck. Who are you playing? Um, uh, never mind. You don't have to explain. I'm sure whatever it is you're up <laughs> to, you know what you're doing. Right? I hope so. Hey, sometimes you gotta go out on a limb for the ones you love, right? Wish my dad had understood that. You won't stay away too long. You'll barely know I was gone. You ready to go, Einstein? Off he goes. Time circuit Time switch. Circuits. Ah, flux capacitor. Uh, Fluxy. <laughs> Fluxy. Boop. Okay, if Doc's gonna get killed on June 14th, 1931, I'll just show up the day before and get him out. I hope you know what you're doing, Doc. June 15th, 1931. Do 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 What? Uh oh. Uh oh. Part of the future. Wow. Hill Valley Exposition. I've got a funny feeling that might have something to do with later on in the game. Because uh, Back to the Future does that a lot. Loading. Nice loading screen. Always enjoy those loadings. What's going on? Einstein, where'd you go now, boy? Hmm. Who's that? Who's that? <laughs> Soup kitchen. Police station. Town. Who's this? Young man? Excuse me, young man? Who? Uh, me? You're the only man in the street, and I'm looking for a man in the street reaction. Naturally, you know about the explosion that destroyed this illegal gin establishment. I read about it, yeah. What's your opinion of Carl Sagan, the stranger who single-handedly did what the law has been unable to do for ten long years, namely, rid Ooh. Hill Valley of the scourge of liquor? Uh... Um... I 
I'm a supporter. Mark me down as a supporter, the young man said, flashing a boyish yet virile grin. Hill Valley needs more upstanding youths like yourself. Do you have a message for the vicious gangsters who still roam these streets? No doubt plotting to corrupt our citizens with another den of booze, sin, and debauchery? Where can I find them? Ask him where I can get the address. Ah, I see! Because you want to blast it to smithereens just like Carl Sagan did. With public-spirited citizens like you around, the lawless element will be on the run in no time. Mr. May I get your name? Yeah, it's... Um... Ooh, I think I'm gonna go with Sonny Crockett. Sonny Crockett! Thank you for sharing your candid opinions, Mr. Crockett. Edna Strickland, Hill Valley Herald. Ooh, it's the old woman. I know. I met you back. I mean, I'm familiar with your work. You read my column? How sweet! I know it's just an etiquette column, but I believe it'll lead to bigger and better- Oh! Einstein, no. Down, boy. Is this wretched creature yours? He assaulted me once before. What's got into you? Aggressive dogs must be kept on leash at all times. It's the law. Look it up. Doc. I gotta find Doc. He'll be in the police station, Marty. Okay, let's head over to that police station. Do 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 do. Walk slowly, Marty. Yeah, that's the slowest trip you're ever gonna get in your life. You know, what, guys, I think I'm gonna leave it there until next time. I'm not sure when next time will be. Um. Ooh, something to look forward to on my channel, um, there's something coming out on, uh, next week, Monday, so you guys should look forward to that, but for now, I'll see you guys next time, goodbye, this has been Geoport Gaming, subscribe for more, peace.